Happy Saturday, everyone. Welcome to the weekend edition of The Couch. I'm Carolina Bermudez. And I'm Jill Nicolini. You can find us every morning, Monday through Friday, on WLNY from 7 to 9 a.m. You get your local news, weather, and traffic every morning. And we also bring you up to date on the stories that are trending and they have everyone talking. All right, have you heard about the multivitamin myth? Little notebook, not a big a little notepad and those you know how you think of all these things as yes. you're laying in bed yes. I write down like three little things yeah. don't forget this don't forget that so just to write a couple of things not a huge to-do list right. then the I say before. the early bird catches the uh, what is the early bird catches worm. the worm right yeah so again no, some people just aren't morning people so how do you kind of adjust Guilty. your attitude <laughs> to the then I say before. the early bird catches the uh, what is the early bird catches worm. the worm right yeah. right These studies we talked about last week that the uh, earlier you wake up the more successful you are. And they're easy tips to make your life more productive. I love them. As simple as getting up earlier in the morning really helps. Well, for us, not really. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, this week on the couch, we had Real Housewives of Beverly Hills newcomer Joyce Gerard D'Ohoven, the beautiful and spunky lady dish about season four and the ups and downs of her first time on reality TV. <laughs> Dankeschön. <laughs> Muchas gracias. I, this, oh. She's fluent in German. She's fluent in Spanish and she could probably understand French. You are one sophisticated lady. You're so sweet. Oh. You're so package. She's so much. kind of cute too. Just a little bit. Oh. All right, so Joyce, welcome and Thank congratulations. You. What is it like being the new kid on the block? It's a li it's going. It's a little bit has its ups and downs. I'm in shock. I thought the pageant girls would be worse than the well, Real Housewives. I know ladies. what I was going to say. You used to do pageants. Yeah, so what's your experience? I remember people would cut dresses and do really bad things backstage in the oh, dressing gosh. room. So I hope it doesn't get to that on the show. Never. Well, You're now, my friend. <laughs> well, now from reality to race cars, this next guest had our whole studio excited. That's because he's NASCAR great Jeff Gordon and he told us what it's like to be the veteran kid on the raceways. Well, a reality show star ruffles feathers and another hairy situation for Kim Kardashian. Entertainment reporter Brian Balthazar joins us now with the morning scoop on all of these stories. So here's a hope for 2014. Maybe we don't hear as many stories about Kim and Justin Bieber. I think that'll happen. Yes. Fingers crossed, right? <laughs> <laughs> we might be out of a job then. I know, that's true. All right, Walking with Dinosaurs in 3D is unlike any animated film you've ever seen. I was thinking it in the car last night, but it was not pretty. Gifts for the holidays this year are all about going high tech. It's called the Shock Box. It is a wireless, so it operates on Bluetooth. So you can take your iPhone, you can take your wireless <laughs> device. Get, come on, give it a throw. No, really? Give it a Seriously, throw. Really? Go I'm gonna see if he breaks. Okay, it. I'm gonna aim. Okay, just not at the camera. Three, two, two. Here it goes. And yeah! Hey, I didn't break it. Shock Box. <laughs> this is a gift for the entire family or for the techie that has everything. How this is, is from it the smartest of all smart. It is a Samsung smart TV that is ultra high definition, so it's four times the definition of a 1080p. What does that mean to the average person at yeah. home? That means if you've got the best of the best, which is 1080p, this is four times better in picture. Now you can't really see it at home, but that picture is so liquidy clear, crystal clear, it looks like you can put your hand through it. And the great thing about Samsung is they've understood that people wow. don't want to see something ugly on their wall. It's almost a bezel design so it looks like a floating piece of glass on your wall but the picture is what makes the difference. How would you like to have that under your uh, Christmas tree okay. when you wake up? Don't even go there Jill. My husband wants that TV after he saw it so I'm in big trouble. <laughs> <laughs> For you. All right. Well the fun doesn't stop there. Don't believe us? Well we're about to work out. Yep. Battle the holiday bulge with our Fit Minutes. They're coming up next on Best of the Couch. Welcome back. It's time now to get into shape so here's this week's Fit Minute with celebrity trainer Dasha Libin. And all, you go for it. And all I'm going to do is reach over and explode with my left leg and then come back over to the opposite side. So I'm going to start off just reaching down all right. and across. It looks like I can do that. Yeah, but now we're going to add a little bit of the ice skater to it. So from here, we're going to stop, find single leg balance, and reach out, come right, back, really good at that. and then right back. So you can do that anytime you want. So I'm going to go to the other side, find my single leg balance. Go, 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 come on. Work it hard, All ladies. Right. I got go for the goal. Yeah. Boom. Wow. Non stop. And where do you feel? Where are you burning right now? I'm Is feeling my abs and my glutes and my legs and my back. What are you feeling, Joni? 15 seconds. I'm okay. You can do it. Let's do it, guys. You're 10, 10 seconds nine, away. Nine, eight. Get up seven, seven, six, five, four, four three, three, two, two one. Go.
and we hope you hang out with us next week. We've got great stuff lined up. And we'll see you Monday morning when we're back. Live from the couch. It is time.